Wow. Amazing. This is kind of a cool shot here, actually. Oh, I love shooting above cars. Oh, smells like pizza over here. It smells like a wood fire pizza. It smells amazing right now. How's it going? You having a shit one? Yeah, good. Thought so. Today we're gonna go shoot. Actually, what what is the car's name? Oh, I don't actually have my phone on here. Car's name is up here. It is a 964 C2 RWB. The first RWB in Toronto. It was made in 2016. Car's got some really, really cool history. And we actually went to a car show um, the day before and saw this car. And then we got offered today to see if we wanted to go out and take some photos of it out here in Toronto. And that's exactly what we're gonna go do. Like I said in a few videos ago, I really wanna hone in on photographing cars that I like, more or less. Uh, I'm sort of done with photographing more modern stuff. It's not that I don't want to photograph it, it's just that like, I really enjoy shooting something that has a bit more story to it or maybe just if it's a classic, it's just got more history. It just feels like there's more character and story in the actual photos itself. And I really love this car even more because it's manual. So if you want me to photograph your car, it has to be manual. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. We have an RWB through this door. Headlights on. I try not to shut it off for any time. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. Shot. I'm gonna have to move it. Too much going on in the background.
I know, man. So, it's so different. There will be so many much more of this. There's more shooting. Because we love it. And then we can do YouTube without other shit. Legit. So good, man. Pretty much how I want to do it. Just mix them. Just balance it. Because whether you like it or not, we make YouTube videos. But, like, you got to figure out how you're going to balance it. This is such a nice angle right here. Straight back shot here. Getting above your subjects, especially for car photography, so crucial. <sighs> oh, it's cold out here. Wow. Wow. Amazing. No. God damn, this thing looks amazing. This is kind of a cool shot here, actually. I'm just gonna shoot the back, so I need the uh, the car to come forward. I need to get the whole car from this angle. Bit more, keep coming. Keep coming. Stop. Yeah. I'm gonna shoot this one in F8. I'll get everything in focus. And then a few landscape, make sure the polarizer is still working. And then some at 1.2 for the depth. That vignette. Oh, I love shooting above cars. Yeah, you get it, babe. Try some different angles. Make sure that polarizer's on. No. Nah. Stop there for now. Straight wheel. Window up. Stay in the car. This one's sick.
All right, it's pretty low lighting out at the moment. Cars just over there. And now something's wrong with the headlights, but it's all right, whatever. We pretty much finished the shoot anyway. Plenty of photos that I'm happy with. You get some good ones too? Yeah, I got some, uh, I'm just trying to get like more creative shit, like reflections and all that stuff. So yeah, good shit. Nice, good work on the seventh era department. All these photos you've seen in today's video have been edited with actually our, both of our new V3 Lightroom presets. So if you haven't got those, I'll leave a link down in the description. And also all the gear that I used in this video, which is mainly just the 105 from Sigma and the 35mm f1.2 from Sigma. I'll also link those in the description as well. You can find those on Amazon. But if you did like this video, maybe you can leave a like down below. Help us out by hitting subscribe. With that all said and done, have a shit one, oh and I will God. see you in the next one. So good when it's live, baby. <laughs>